Everyone knows C++ is the king of speed. It powers high frequency trading, game engines, and the very browser you are watching this on. But fast is not magic, it's architecture specifically, it comes down to three things, no middle management, no manual memory management, and the constant fear of failure. The first thing is C++ compiles directly to the machine code, unlike Python, which needs an interpreter to translate line by line like a confused tourist, or Java, which relies on the JVM. C++ directly talks to the hardware, the heavy lifting is done once by the compiler, there is no translation layer slowing you down, it is just raw code and CPU screaming in agony together. Second thing is, this is a big one, is the lack of garbage collector. Languages like Go or Java have a background process, a janitor that pauses your program to clean up unused memory. C++ does not have a janitor, you are the janitor. You control exactly when memory is allocated and free. This means zero random CPU spikes and deterministic performance. It also means you forget to free a pointer and there is no safety net, just a memory leak and that's slowly consuming your RAM until the operation kills by the operating system. Now, now before we move forward, if you're a founder of some SaaS tool or dev tool company, I also create corner for you guys. So if you want to work with me, link is in the description. Now let's get back to the video. Finally, the zero overhead abstraction in C++, things like template are resolved at compile time. The compiler optimized abstraction away. You get the coding speed of high level syntax with the execution speed of handwritten assembly. C++ is fast because it trusts you completely, it removes the safety rails, the virtual machines, the padding, it hands you a loaded gun and assumes you won't shoot your foot off. That is why 40 years later, there's nothing comes even close to C++.